All right. So about future of learning, this is definitely a topic of very close to my heart. If I look uh, like last 500 years, um, I believe we humans have collectively failed to bring a defining revolution in the education sector. I mean, we had seen tremendous amount of changes from bullet car to airplanes, but we really failed to take our kids from a traditional classroom environment. to a more inclusive and interactive environment and this certainly time to uh, time for a change and uh, i'd like to share some of the numbers what we have seen uh, from various studies done by moocs or other platform um, and i think uh, that will give a perspective what happened with the digitization when we think about education so our children are certainly growing up in an era where information is accessible um, at their finger tips and where the ability to adapt innovate and collaborate is uh, paramount online education offers a gateway to this new era of learning enabling us to tailor education to our kids uh, needs uh, their preferences and uh, diverse learning styles so when we dive into some of the data i mean uh, the statistics uh, they said like 63% of us student uh, are utilizing online learning resources regularly so that number is very large the data from coursera also looks very promising where the us topping the stand uh, standing with more than 17 million people getting enrolled in online learning um india is second highest that's 13.6 million so the ad- adaptation was also pretty fast but the key data which is really astounding um advantage of online learning lies in the ability to significantly uh, enhance learner uh, retention rates uh, ranging from anywhere 25% to an impressive 60% uh, surpassing the more traditional approach of one on one tutoring which typically yields a retention rate of 8 to 10%. The retention rate means uh, how much information you are retaining. 8 to 10% traditional versus 25 to all the way to 60% uh, through online medium is definitely a multifold and it's not a surprise this is primarily attributed to the flexibility online learning offers enabling a student to revisit and reinforce their understanding at their own pace uh, thus granting them greater control over their learning journey every person is different uh, when we think about younger segment so i mean these numbers are inclusive of all kind of segments but when we think younger segments uh, what we are targeting like 7 to 16 i think online alone uh, where it's uh, let's say asynchronous pre recorded videos it doesn't work because there is only so many students will have motivation um, that number sits somewhere under 5% where they will able to go through the journey all by themselves the students need several things they need continuous uh, maneuvering monitoring um, appreciation uh, support but also inspiration the inspiration happen primarily i'll say limited incidents by teachers but a lot of inspiration happen if they are surrounded by the same age uh, students and that's why we offer at moonpreneur a classroom session so these are online classes but they are synchronous instructor led in a cohort format so they have let's say these are technical session they have another five six student like them sitting um same age similar learning uh, uh, pattern some student learn fast some go for slow pace and and things like that and this is very important and this is only possible when we bring this kind of online instructor led uh, synchronous learning especially for uh, 7 to 16 year segment replicating same thing in a brick and mortar setup is very difficult because right now we have several thousand students we can create batches uh, based upon their prior knowledge their learning pattern uh, their age and all kind of things because we have a lot of choices to pick from right now we are creating anywhere from 25 to 30 batches new batches every month so a lot of flexibility is there imagine if i am in a brick and mortar setup i might have two or three section maybe barely 50 to 70 students to pick from very difficult to create anything like this synchronous session combined with a synchronous session like a pre prep and then maybe post prep or revision which is only recorded um, can do wonders uh, we have already seen what numbers uh, look like uh, when it comes to retention rate this kind of synchronous hybrid learning i believe is the future of education especially for the younger segment so think about accessibility and inclusivity online learning is available to anyone Uh, regardless of location or socio economic status 
um, right now our primary focus is us market but soon we will like to take it to across the globe personalized learning paths as i said like uh, if we can create all these batches in based upon many many uh, criteria and this way online learning can be tailored to meet the individual needs and learning style of each student where they can still have inspiration they can still have the company but uh, things are running at their pace uh, this way you bring the more efficient skill development uh, it can be more efficient this way uh, the online learning than traditional classroom as a student can learn at their own pace and also focus on the skills they need to develop and uh, this just gives a lot more flexibility the global exchange or global exposure right now we have many cohort where students are joining from uk and canada and us and india uh, uh, africa and other places um, in our traditional classroom atmosphere it's not possible and the world is more global than ever and it, it is just going to get even more aggressive there uh, the whole interactive learning uh, online learning can be more interactive uh, than traditional classroom learning a uh, student can participate in discussion collaborate on projects interact with their teachers uh, and other classmates in real time i mean their exercises can be tailor made a lot of data can be collected and provide as a feedback and uh, for their learning mechanism so it can be more efficient a flexible scheduling and learning pace it can be a lot more flexible than traditional classroom learning as a student can choose when and where they want to learn and then uh, uh, data driven insights like uh, all the online learning platform can collect data on student's progress which can be used to improve the learning experience and identify areas where student need additional support i mean the individual data collection on the learning pattern is almost impossible when you are in a traditional classroom setup i certainly believe that online education especially the synchronous one has the potential to transform the educational landscape for the younger segment it can provide students with the skills they need to succeed especially in this uh, 21st century workforce and it can help them develop into well-rounded students uh, or individuals can help them uh, for the future education college admission future of work uh, more will come so thank you